a string of fentanyl-related deaths recently in California, Cal Poly is looking to equip students with what they need to know about the synthetic opioid before it becomes a problem. KSBY's Aaron Faye joins us live from Cal Poly this morning with more on what's being done there. Good morning, Aaron. Good morning, Neil. Good morning, Janelle. 62% of overdose deaths in San Luis Obispo County are attributed to opioid related deaths. And they're saying here in the county, as well as at Cal Poly, that they are working to make sure they get ahead of the problem before it becomes an issue with students. Cal Poly is now offering trainings on what to do in the case of a fentanyl overdose after observing the national problem. Prevention specialist and health educator Kirsten Vinther says the university wants to get ahead before fentanyl becomes a problem on campus. Gosh, um, I think the more accurate question was, is where is fentanyl not being put in? Cal Poly distributes overdose prevention kits in a couple of different ways. They're available to students for free at the campus pharmacy. I do pop-up trainings, so Thursdays 11 to 12, I sit outside and I do trainings with students. I teach them how to use it. The trainings take about 10 minutes. Vinther says she would like to see a prevention kit in the hands of every student, staff, and faculty member if possible. Last year, we gave out 291 overdose prevention kits. Um, we're just starting to ramp up for this year. Uh, my goal is to at least double that. Each of the kits contain two doses of Narcan and a CPR shield. Sending it back to you. And according to the Slow County DA, illegal fake pills with fentanyl are being mass produced, designed to look like pharmaceutical grade prescription pills. Yeah, and that can make them especially dangerous. Aaron, what are some of the symptoms of an overdose and what can they look out for? Neil Janelle, they can look out for nail beds and lips turning blue, with people losing consciousness and labored breathing. All right, thank you, Aaron. Well, people can find naloxone, the overdose reversal medication at four Slow County drug and alcohol service locations in Paso Robles, Atascadero, San Luis Obispo, and Grover Beach.